What up, it's Melvin7 here and today I'm bringing you more of an objective based video uh, showing you exactly what I have accomplished during uh, the first, well it's not even the first official week of FIFA, like the pre-week of FIFA since it launches officially tomorrow. Uh, I am going to redeem my rivals rewards but I'm not going to open them and I suggest you do the same for those who have saved theirs. Uh, don't open it until one to watches are released tomorrow. Uh, weekly competition rewards are now available. Yep, I know that. So yeah, we did finish in uh, rank one in division three. So we get two rare mega packs and a rare Electrum players pack. I'm not going to take untradeable this early on. I want the coins. Well, <laughs> I want the coins from the packs, obviously. So we're going to take the tradable rewards. And uh, yeah, we are now in division two. I gotta be honest, I wanna be back in Division 3 unless I can make it all the way to Division 1 because the rewards for Division 2 are absolutely ass. I, I don't understand it, they're worse than Division 2s. Uh, if we find Rank 1, okay, the coins are alright, but two Mega Packs, a rare Gold Pack, and a rare Mega Pack. Oh. Okay. My mate must have been lying to me. That's actually not as bad as I thought. Um, he, he must have been reading out Tier 2 rewards. Yeah, okay, he was. Right, so, <laughs> so tier 1 isn't as bad as I thought. So, okay, right, I'll try and uh, stick in for Division 2. But anyhow, I'll show you my team on Saturday's video, I think. Um, the one I'm using for rivals. Although that might change as well, because uh, I might be selling it to try and get profit, that sort of thing. But, uh, yeah, we'll just get into the rest of the video, to be honest. Uh, I've got a lot of objectives to show you. Uh, I'll show you my save packs. I will have an extra 50k pack as well. Uh, so we've got two 25k packs, 200k packs, uh, two rare megas and a rare electrum. We will also have a bonus 50k pack at least, possibly even more. But anyhow, let's get on with the rest of the video. Right, so these are the objectives that I have completed. As you can see, I've only got play online, uh, squad battles and co-op and conquer. I'm sure I'll get them done, but we've done early access, we've done three nations, done Mbappe's storyline, and then the rest. Oh, and human and machine, actually. So uh, we'll, we'll actually see how, how far the community have got with that one. So yeah, we need another 160 million XP to get the next uh, stadium theme there. Uh, in terms of milestones, we're doing quite well as well. Um, rivals mastery is getting there, uh, finishing and assist. Uh, I am working my way through the 500 assists and the 500 goals with an 85 rated team for the 200k packs. That'll be class. Um, yeah, there's just a, a couple of other things, but I'm going to open those packs. Uh, we've also done the, all of the foundations. I just I didn't even focus on that, that just came by the by. Um, yeah, so we've got two little packs here. One's a 5k pack, one's a premium Electrum. So six, six gold, six rare, th sorry, six gold, six silver, and three rare. So the chances of getting something in that is pretty dire. I don't know if that's tradable either, because hopefully it is, because it's the human versus machine community event. So, it would be a bit of a kick in the face if it's untradeable, but we all know, yeah. Soon, I'm going to discard all these, and yeah. That was a tradable pack for the foundations, actually, so that's not too bad, but come on, at least be a board. So, we have a rare goal. Do we have a walkout? We don't. Oh, we've got a board, though. That's what I asked for. See what we get. Um, ah, my teep. Hmm. Uh, hmm. I'd... I'd don't know. Let's see if it's tradable. It's not tradable. We also got Pope, Grealish. Yeah, it's not too bad. Wait, was this a prime? Yeah, it must have been a prime because it was six rares, but uh, yeah, it could have been worse. Right, well, that should be the 100 finesse shot uh, for the 50k pack. Uh, most of it I've done legitly, but uh, as you can see, uh, <laughs> oh my god, they didn't even get a 10 rate, 19 goals. <laughs> Obviously, it's on a beginner uh, or, or whatever the, the first difficulty is. But yeah, I needed 36 finesse shots. Um, I believe I've got 35. Um, uh, sorry, I believe I got 37 there. Uh, all of them were finesse shots, I think. So we should have the 50k pack. Um, 
Yeah, and obviously most people will probably know that you can get that, but if not, yeah, it's it's a free 50k pack, obviously untradeable, but all you have to do is score 100 finesse shots, so, you know, three or four games on squad battles on the easiest difficulty, and that should be good. That was also my 30th game, so we unlocked the ghoul song. Uh, what else have we unlocked? We've unlocked foundations, nobody really cares about that. Silver contracts pack, wow, unbelievable. Um yeah that's 500 coins and then we should have the one that i'm on about right so we've got assist mastery 50 uh, midfield passes nice so that gives us the pitch trophy i don't think we can use the trophy yet though because uh, i don't think we've unlocked it i think you need to play 40 or 50 games to unlock that uh but anyhow where's the finishing that should be yep 100 finesses so here we go, the 50k pack. I saw someone get Ronaldo and uh, Sergio Ramos in that. So, you know, I'll take that. Uh, but I don't know which video this is going to be added on to as per my usual uh, stuff that I say. <laughs> but I am still in my early access. I did do the glitch to get 10 more hours, uh, which is how I've managed to play 30 games already. So we've got the ele elephant goal song. But anyhow, here we go, 50k pack. Come on, please at least be a walkout you know an informed bruno would be great an icon i don't know if you can get them in the free packs it is not a walkout it's a board at least though there's plenty of good boards uh uruguayan center mid yo velverde that is actually sick i'm a bit gutted he's the the um 83 rated card like i'm a bit good there isn't an 85 or an 84 but he is brilliant i've already got him uh so i can sell the other one i've got um I think he's about 60k at the minute. Is there anything else that goes for anything? Overall, that wasn't great. Um, I, I know I, value-wise it is, but uh, 183 is a little bit disappointing. So how much is he? I bought him for 54k. And yeah, he's roughly about the same, I think. So I will offload this one. So overall, it's a success for me. Uh, I just got lucky with the board that it was. Uh, I think I'm going to list it for about 58, see if he sells. Uh, in terms of the rest, not amazing, but uh, yeah. Let me know what you got in your 100 finesse shot 50k pack. And yeah, this might be the end of whatever video it's on. Right, so I've done three of these two rare gold players packs. Uh, I've done 10 in total. The other seven weren't really that good. I got a couple of boards. I don't want to get caught in the trap of doing loads of SPCs just for the sake of it. I want to have a massive coin balance by the end of FIFA. Uh, seeing that, this Sandro Tonali, I don't want to do every single SBC for the sake of doing them, as I say, but because he's so cheap at the minute, 80 rated uh, teams aren't very much. You're looking at maybe 10k, uh, maybe 15 ma uh, maximum, and there will be some SBCs down the line that I will want to do, and uh, sometimes they require a one to watch. So, worst case scenario, doesn't get any upgrades he's just a one to watch that i can put into an sbc to get an untradeable one to watch that's a little bit better or whatever so i'm gonna do that um wow the menus are so laggy with sbcs i don't know why uh he does look like a good card i'm not gonna lie um but again he needs a couple of upgrades really and uh yeah because it was so cheap i thought why not uh, i was debating whether to do it but i've convinced myself to actually go out and do it um and yeah we've got three packs left uh we also have done a lot of objectives i was going to stick this in a little segment later but uh since i'm going to be saving my rival rewards i might as well show you anyway i've been doing a little bit of trading as well selling uh belgium players uh buying them for 500 600 coins and then just offloading them for 750 a little bit of a you know advice uh which will be out of date by the time this video is out i apologize but marquee matchups look what sells i'll do videos that are a bit more up to date on that of course later down the line but yeah in terms of objectives we've done some of the big ones uh for milestones i'm going to save the packs so we've done finishing mastery which is 85 rated squad you need 500 goals with that so i've been doing it on beginner on uh, squad battles most of that getting between 30 and 40 uh goals a game and that gives you a 100k pack, which I will be saving for one to watch. We've also, as you can see, uh, have done assist mastery. Um, 
almost anyway. We need four more games. Uh, obviously, I'll redeem that and we'll open them when One to Watch is come out on uh, Friday. But we've also done the crossing and the 500 assists. And obviously, I did that the exact same way as the uh, goals, which means that that's another 100k pack for One to Watches, which is really, really nice. We've also done the co op win 25 matches uh, which is another 25k pack so we've got a lot of packs to open and that's without the uh the rivals rewards that we will be getting uh, i'll obviously have a 50k pack uh in four more games and then maybe a couple of other little packs to open uh in terms of actual objectives it's just the co-op squad battles play online and daily objectives i've done everything else uh we are as high as we possibly can be at the minute uh, we're level 11 and that's without any weekly objectives which i think is pretty impressive uh this will see it's got a week left we might get to tier 5 as a community who knows uh, obviously the game fully uh launches on friday in two days at the time of recording this video but anyhow i'm gonna have to be really really careful with what i open here uh, i don't want to open any of these but i will open the three two rare gold playoffs packs just to have something to open in this little segment i suppose so the first one is not a walkout it's not a board either so we're going to skip and hope that it's saint maximum well it can't be actually he's uh, in form at the minute anthony that's actually not a bad card other than the weak foot um nice little starter player uh dupe is a dupe uh we're going to discard that i don't think he goes for anything um and then we're gonna open this and then one more and hopefully uh we'll get a walkout because as i say i've done seven of them uh prior so this is the ninth in total you just wouldn't have seen them in video uh i think the best i've got is like 83 rated cards that's a bit misleading but an 81 isn't too bad there um the 83s weren't anything special though so it was pointless showing but again i don't want to get caught in that sbc trap where i'm just doing constant ones rinsing the club and just uh you know wasting all the cards essentially uh so no boards unfortunately we'll uh see what this one is it is ah oh, eric Bay. that's not too bad uh if i was to sell my team and get a cheaper team he would go in it uh since he's untradeable and yeah he's he's valued at about 10 uh well just shy of 10k so that's not too bad 